One key difference compared to the professional version is the availability of 3D tools. In addition, we will also see some more advanced features for 2D, such as patterns, sheet sets, and PDF import. To begin with, let's take a look at the 3D solids and Boolean operations. Here again, it will look familiar to any experienced CAD user. I can, for example, create two solids and subtract one solid from the other. Another smart way to work with solids is the push and pull command that enables you to extrude faces. This is a very intuitive way to modify the solids. This operation is facilitated by the Dynamics CCS, which is the equivalent in draft site of the Dynamics UCS in AutoCAD. When it is activated, it will automatically change the CSS for you when you work on the 3D faces. To continue with 3D features, it is interesting to see how 3D solids can also be used as arrays, which are also known as patterns in DraftSight. With the Pattern 3D command, we can repeat a solid according to a specific pattern in three dimensions. See, for example, how useful this can be for our 3D bridge. Patterns are also very nice to use with 2D entities. Once again, the command is a different name in DraftSight, but an alias is defined. So you can either enter the DraftSight command pattern, or if you don't remember it, simply enter array. The pattern can repeat selected entities not only in a linear way, but also along any arc or any path. In this drawing, we want to replicate an armchair in our auditorium. We configure the distances and quantities. If we later change our mind, we can come back to the dialog to change the settings, or use the grips to easily vary the quantities. Here's another example with circular copies. We can repeat this chair in a circular way. Finally, we have the option to instead select a path for the pattern. In all these cases, the patterns we created with DraftSight will be recognized as arrays in AutoCAD and vice versa. When you work on a large project, it is very likely that multiple drawings will be created. This is where the sheet sets features can make a big difference. As you can see in this palette, the sheet set manager helps to organize the project, combining and reordering sheets coming from multiple drawings. One key advantage is that my project is always ready to print, no matter how many drawings and how many pages. It includes support for templates and fields that will automatically update the title blocks of the pages. It is also very important that DraftSight supports the DST format, which is used by AutoCAD to save and share sheet sets. So the sheet sets created by DraftSight can be used in AutoCAD and vice versa. Finally, with the publish command, you can print all or just a portion of the sheet sets. You can print a paper or a PDF file. As an example, we have generated a PDF file that contains views from multiple drawings for this project. With DraftSight Professional, you can print each drawing to PDF. The difference in DraftSight Premium is that you can additionally use sheet sets and the publish command to organize multiple drawings and combine them into a single PDF. Speaking of the PDF format, the PDF import functionality is another key difference. With PDF import, you can take the drawings that have been exported to PDF and convert them back to DWG. This will keep you from having to redraw everything when you only have a PDF and not the DWG drawing. For example, how we can import the PDF file we showed earlier. As this PDF contains multiple sheets, I can select the sheets I want to import. Note also that DraftSight offers a batch import option if you want to batch process the conversion of multiple PDF files. In the options, we can also determine how layers should be created. When the PDF contains layer information, we can simply use it. If not, we can place all the entities in one layer, or group entities by color. After the import, the content will be inserted as a block. This enables you to adjust the scale after insertion. The last step is to explode the block, which enables you to modify the content afterward. To conclude, we can see that the additional features of DraftSight Premium can bring your productivity to the next level. If you're an experienced CAD user, you'll definitely appreciate the added value. Learn more about DraftSight Premium and the DraftSight portfolio at www.draftsight.com.